Hey, what's good, y'all? It's your boy Don from The Don Show, and we are back for another music video reaction. And as promised, I brought my dad's brother back, Alani. Okay, so look, last video that me and him did, y'all was talking about us doing dance practice videos. So we looked through the comments. We're trying to make sure we get all these done because we really want to respond to these. We have not looked at none of them, so we don't know what none of these look like, as promised. Pure reactions. Feel me? <laughs> so what we're going to be doing today is actually Stray Kids Backdoor Dance Practice video. I believe this came out about five months ago. So me and my dance brother, we're going to react to these. But before we do that, I just want to say this. Thank y'all so much for liking, commenting, subscribing. Um, I am at 393 subscribers. I'm truly thankful for that. Like, it, this means a lot to me. My dance brother, he's happy about it. I'm telling him every night how we get new subscribers and we get new comments. So please continue letting us know what you like to watch, okay? Um, from the K-pop community, from the hip-hop, from the jazz and R&B, if it's something that you suggest for us to want to look at, please let me know. We're making a list. I got a whiteboard set up for y'all. making a list, and we're just going down a list. So, for real, for real, Jane Lee, thank y'all so much. We appreciate it. And today, we're going to give y'all straight kids backdoor dance practice video because y'all asked for it. And also, my dance brother let me know that y'all also was talking about us having to do the performances, like the live performance stage stuff. We got those on the way, too. So, those are coming out as well. So... Y'all got a lot of videos to watch. Y'all yeah. better watch all these videos because yeah. y'all are burning my batteries out. No, <laughs> but but for real, for real, we're going to give it to y'all because we genuinely are watching every single video um, right in front of y'all. Like, we did not watch this at all. I set it up. Boom. That's it. We good. And we about to start. All right. So let's get started. Yo, 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 hold up, 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 up. Listen, yeah. we're dance choreographers. So let's go ahead and get into it. <laughs> Would you like to go first of what you just saw? If we only 24 seconds all right. in. All right, all right, all right. Listen, 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 listen. Mm. So me and Don was talking the other day in regards to I don't think people really take into account the kind of work dancers put into their pieces. Right. It doesn't because it's there's clearly a difference when you're practicing. Yes. There's a difference when you're doing a music video. Yes. And there's definitely a difference when you're doing a performance. Yes. These are different categories that have different approaches to them. Yes. However, the one consistent in all of them is the effort that you got to go all out in them. Yeah. Because if you're just doing a walkthrough in the practice, in, in the in the practice and all that type of stuff, yes. it's gonna show in your music videos, it's gonna show in your performance, it's gonna, you're gonna slack off. Every line, every single alignment, symmetry of the movements are literally gonna play a part. So when you're practicing, you have your rehearsals where you clear up the transitions and the formations, but then you have to run that full out. And if that is not together, then you have to run all over again until you get your solid three. Mm -hmm. I always talk about a solid three, where you get solid, pieces that are done yep. and this is after just a rehearsal yep. of fixing stuff now you gotta run three solid consistence of the whole video mm -hmm. without yep. stopping now mind you there are your walkthroughs yes you gotta walk throughs to find out placements where we're we gonna go. be at That's, yep. what it's gonna look like yep. for angles yes. for effectiveness yes. all that good stuff i'm getting chills watching i'm getting chills right now but this is it, 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 that part plays a part but then when you actually go forth with the through with the, with the practice mm -hmm. It's got you got to hit it and hit it hard, and the and the way they hit it is the same way they hit in the music video. Because mm -hmm. I'm literally paying attention to the all the way to the person that's at the end, and then mm -hmm. and the one that's at the beginning that's leading the way. All that's gonna play a part because if I was the head choreographer, if I see the person in the back, it's not going full out. Then I stop the music and we have to run it again. Yep. It's it's a different level when it comes to practice, and they're working hard right now. So let's yeah. go. Yeah. <laughs> Right there. Uh, all right. Hold on. I'll be back. <laughs> God dang it. Here we go. All right. Let's let's be clear about this. There, another consistency. Their their transitions. Mm -hmm. How they execute transitions. 
same way I've seen in their music videos. We haven't seen performances yet, so I'm looking forward to how that's gonna feel because performance just that's that's like this it's live. So you know, but this right here, mm -hmm. the transitioning is so sharp and so beautiful. Yes, I mean, I that like just just watching all that. I'm like, man, the way they're attacking it. Another thing you'll notice in practice videos, you'll see a little bit more focus than um, more focus in their face because they're trying to get it. And this is probably this could be probably maybe the first three, maybe five of them doing doing this uh, doing this sequence so that they get make sure they got it down. And then probably after that, they're gonna start putting their facial expressions in and so forth and so forth. But this is more so kind of like you know, hey, we're, we're working right now. So you kind of see right. a little bit of the work faces, but right. anything else, I mean, like the transitions, the 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 um, the intensity um, and the intentionality behind it, mm -hmm. outstanding. Yeah, definitely outstanding. And then you can tell that they're focusing on the formations very well. Even the people that's in the back, even the dancers that's in the back, the artists, they are also making sure that everybody's put together. Mm -hmm. So you can tell that they're transitioning over to a next part of the stage or where the performance is going to be at. So. I'm, I'm with it. Let's yeah. go ahead and see what else they got on there because I'm, I'm with it right now. Let's go. Mm. Nice. Okay. Okay. Listen, I'm gonna be honest with you. If you're not a dancer and you've been watching this dance practice video, I'm gonna tell you like this. I promise you, they probably was running that part a lot. Yes. It's that ripple, that domino effect of that ripple, of that transition, get into that, you gotta make sure that's clean because the group just split. So now you have a choreography on the left and the right, upstage and downstage, all these different directions moving. So this is already playing a part of the choreography. This is crazy. And, and pay and pay attention because I see also in the last one, I forgot to mention the last and the second time we paused was I can see in the music videos, this is where this is where this part was in this scene, this part was in that scene. Right. They, they're doing it all at once. Right. Right here. So pay attention. So also if you're you're watching this practice video from and being able to translate it to the music video absolutely but pay attention to how they will probably effectively do this in a performance on stage because you have to keep character like even in practice you have to keep character of the practice of your attitude how mm -hmm. your face looks so even if you're like a let's say if you're a pretty boy or you or you're like the pretty boy or are you the cocky one all that character needs to play a part right now in practice it's like before be the there. video before the video we have to start going into that attitude right away because if we don't practice that right now then it's going to showcase itself on a music video or in a concert and on tour you have to be consistent practicing with character got to come on come on there we go wow that 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 Okay. Listen, now you see it, yeah. Yep. Uh, uh. Repeat. Yes. Bye. And it looks decent. Oh, all right. <sighs> Man, so again, I don't think people really take into account the effort it takes mm -hmm. when it comes to putting pieces together for dancers. And disclaimer, we're not saying, we're not talking to the ones that don't, yeah. that already know. If you know this already, thank we're you. not talking to you. We're talking to the ones that's learning right now. Yeah, this, yeah. So thank you if you do know, but for those that don't know, just notification, FYI. Uh, and this is, this is more so a general notification. A lot right. of people don't understand that, that, that work it takes right. to put in yeah, exactly. for a performance piece. And the fact that they did this and I did not see not too much. I didn't really see too much difference in the first time they did that. This chorus part of the uh, performance yes. looks the exact same. Transitions was amazing, and seeing how 
I now see like in the one, and it's like again, different scenes. Yes, different scenes. And so they set this choreo like it seems, man. They set it up like it seems, like it's all sectioned off, mm -hmm. but it tra like the transitions are phenomenal. Transition in choreography is not an easy thing to do because a lot of times. people literally be like, dance, 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 stop. Yep. And they'll walk to the next position and they're not dancing or grooving to the next position. You got to and that's irritated. I don't care what genre of music you're doing. What we're looking for is a clean transition. One and two and three and four and five and six and seven wow. and eight. Dot, dot, bop, bop. That is a major. Okay, man. sorry, we getting into our dance bag right now. So Oh man. <laughs> Same thing. Now it's in a different yeah, now it's in a different location. Oh, oh. Ba, 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 da, 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 boom boom. Ah! Okay, okay. Okay, so I'm gonna stop right there. So, now when you watch this video, the, the ripple, you know how they going under each other and hitting with the bang, hitting with the bang, hitting with the bang. They did it three different ways of doing it. It's three different ways that they did it. You had a left one, you had a right one, and now the last one is basically centered. So pay attention to that because it's actually okay in your choreography, especially if you're going to be going on tour with this, you have something repetitive in it and you can just change the location that it is that's on stage because it's something that you want the audience to be able to follow at the same yes. time. We have yes. different levels of how we make our choreography where it's like, oh my God, it's on a competitive level. Mm -hmm. Or we have the choreography where people can follow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cause, yeah, because you're, you're looking at stage performances. Yeah. You want to give as much variety to your piece as possible because you have so many different dynamic uh, yes. dimensions. A lot of people, this is for the general crowd again, a lot of people are used to your stage where like this is the stage and the mm -hmm. audience is out there. Yes. There's sometimes where the stage is a circle. And you've got to showcase to the audience over there, yes. there, behind you, diagonal, in all different directions. Why? Because, of course, everybody wants to see it. No one wants to look at your back the whole time. Yes. So they have to add different dynamics and formality. And I've dealt with that before. Uh -huh. In uh, uh, both group pieces and duo pieces where I'm performing and we had to make a switch up because the stage was, was, a, was a, a pentagon. Oh, yeah. I remember there was a time where uh, I, I performed in Nashville. With um with my dance partner at the time, and we got on the stage and it was like we didn't know we didn't know we thought it was gonna be an outward stage but we got there we had to make a, a switch on the fly mm -hmm. like okay we're gonna do this at this point in time we're gonna come over here we're gonna come over there it's diff it's different and so it's better to have it prepped yep. beforehand all these different angles so, so you would you not be concerned exactly that's basically what he's saying so you won't have no concerns shout out to straight kids with this shout out. <laughs> Now they spread it out. Ouch. Yup. Bop, bop, that. Nice. Hey, hey. This is actually a killer. This is a killer part right here. Ooh. <laughs> With the locking still. Mm. Dink, 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 dink. Hold up. So look, before we go into this dope part, I know this other part about to be dope, we're close to the end. Oh the one thing that's dope that I'm seeing from them is that you can tell, like you said, like they're they are actually studying. And that's one thing about this. Like you can tell that they're studying doing the homework. I'm seeing house, I've seen crump in this, I've seen some breaking in this, and now I'm seeing locking in this. And you can see a little bit of swing dancing. Mm -hmm. Like you can see that as well. There, there's so much, uh, it's, it's, it's always good to see someone who has variety to to their to their artwork because it means that they can connect to a lot of people on different uh from different areas yes and so to see them and to also know that they have an appreciation uh, it kind of makes me think of like uh jabberwockies jabberwockies you're gonna see a little bit of everything when you watch them perform absolutely and so they're gonna be able to like any which is why the dance world the performance world loves them so much mm -hmm. because it's like okay we're taking 
our particular individual faces out of the equation, and mm-hmm. we're gonna have you see us as a group, and we're gonna and, you, and we're gonna you're gonna see everything from us. Yeah, something that you can connect to, and that's just and to see that in a practice video, or in, in this particular performance piece where they throw a little bit of everything in there and they're doing it as best as they can, uh, outstandingly, mm-hmm. it's just something that you gotta appreciate. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I'm with it. I'm with it. I'm with it. I'm absolutely with it. I'm with it. So, my final review is this. Um, and it's actually mine is simple. The way they worked in practice, for real, for real, looks great. Like, you know, the from them running these rehearsals, running these movements together, and then the fact that this the choreography that is set on this, I would enjoy watching this in a concert. And I'm okay watching the music video. Yes. Like for real. Like that's that's my take on it. But I hope that the way we had broke this down, like how important it was for them to have character, the positions that they was carrying, like you seen everyone was moving, everybody was in, in take. You every if, when you're a group, when you're a group, especially a group that can sing or rap, everyone's paying attention to everybody because they're looking for their favorite. Yeah. So everybody has to be in tune. Mm-hmm. If you the chill one, or you the hype one, or you the angry one, or you the one that's like beastly with it, whoever you are in that group, your favorite, um, basically, you're gonna be watching them. Yeah. Your favorite, you're gonna watch. So, for me, that's learning about straight kids. Like I'm, I'm new to this, and I'm looking out who's who, who's gonna be my favorite. Mm-hmm. I'm paying attention to this choreography, and it, yeah. I won't change anything, to be honest with you. Like, no gassing, for real, for real. I won't change on the choreography. Yeah. I'm good. My um, my conclusion to that, first to follow up, is yes. Uh, it's it's definitely something to take in consideration. The uh, the level of detail yes. that, oh, that you put that yeah. you put into something. Yeah. Okay. You know, the, you level, that one. the level of detail that's put into everything. And even in the first video that I watched from them, um, the intention when mm-hmm. you dance and you put intention in everything we can feel it mm-hmm. and so to talk to the characters whatever character that you again we've, again, we've been in multiple dance performances mm-hmm. and the crowd is going to look for their favorite as he said yes and you're going to find that one that's like man i i'm kind of like that guy that's kind of like the rebel and i like that rebel in the group right you know i'm I, you know I'm, i tend to be like you know the uh the sexy smooth suave type yep. of person I like that person. I connect with that person. So you know, you tend, so that's kind of that's kind of how yeah. it is. Um, in the practice video, just to, you know, I'm because I'm, 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 I want to try to be a critic. Yeah. Uh, I only saw like just one part, and it wasn't far off. Mm-hmm. It wasn't. It was. It was like they were center stage, and the two after the one uh, in the front went out. I'm just looking at the angle wise, distance wise. It was a little different. Oh, uh, yeah. And you know what? I wouldn't be surprised if they made an adjustment due for the music video and kept a certain segment when they do a live mm-hmm. performance. Because it, it, you know that happens. And that's the main reason why you got to know your places yeah. where you're dancing at. That's yeah. the main reason why. Yeah. So, yeah, absolutely. So, but, and, and, but it was the most important thing about those particular kind of like small little things that happen in whatever the case may be, you still dance through it. Because yeah, no you one, keep going. No one's gonna notice. Yeah. I'm only saying it just because I'm like I'm like I'm trying to look for where they may make like yeah. a short step. And it's just and, and it's and it's all respect. Yeah. It's all respect. It's just saying like, man, these dudes I have no complaints about this. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So I just was outstanding job. Like, yeah. Outstanding job. Through. So listen y'all, if y'all enjoy us doing these dance practice videos, please Send us some more. Let us know which ones you want us to check out. I'm we, loving this. Yeah, we would definitely get our point of view. And thank you, because you fact that y'all also understand that there's no hate and shade throwing when it comes to us making these videos. Mm-hmm. We are we are people that travel the world for dancing. We live yeah. this art. We love the creativity. And I'm excited to see what else they have. But look, y'all, if y'all enjoyed this video, please make sure you like, subscribe, and share. And make sure you comment if you got anything else you want us to check out yes. during this journey, during this time. We're going to keep checking them out. But other than that, I appreciate y'all so much. We, had, uh, bef- we are now 393 subscribers. Again, thank y'all so much for the likes and the love. Uh, appreciate y'all. Other than that, I will see y'all soon. Y'all take care. Peace. Peace.